Hello everyone and welcome to my playthrough of Jade Cocoon's Story of the Tamamayu. I am your host Rabbit and I am ready to rock and roll. I'm feeling really fantastic today. I had a little bit of a cold slash a sore throat the last two to three days. I'm not sure if it was technically a cold. It might have just been due to the fact that I was working um, at the university and since I was running the back to school promotions event for students and doing like the event planning and all that crap, I guess I was just talking too much and trying to yell over loud rowdy students. So either way, my voice was really hoarse yesterday and almost went out and I had to cut short my recording session. But today hopefully I'll be able to get a lot recorded and uploaded for you guys. It is August 30th and it's 11.23 a.m. So yeah, I have no reason not to feel fantastic. So let us go ahead and dive right in. Where we last left off together a couple days ago, we advanced onward to the Moth Forest, and we've really just begun scouring the place, looking for treasure, looking for skeleton keys, and capturing new minions. And I did want to say that off camera, I don't know if I mentioned this at the end of the last video, but I did take a moment and go to capture the Shulia, which I accidentally killed. I'm stronger than I thought I was, so... I'm trying to think. I think that's everything. Let's just continue exploring. So yeah, hopefully you guys can hear me well and I don't sound as raspy as yesterday. I uploaded the first few videos for my playthrough of Magic Knight Ray Earth on the Sega Saturn. I'm really excited about playing that. So hopefully you guys are as thrilled as me. And it looks like a new minion, Pat Sparon. I don't think we've seen this guy yet. I believe we saw the blue version of him, so I gotta take it easy. I really don't want to kill this guy, so hmm. I might. Oh man, guys, this is so nerve-wracking because I hate it when I kill the minion that I'm wanting to capture. And then after this, I have to decide who I want to get doubles of and how I'm wanting to really do this, so. I'm just really anxious because I know I can't return back to this place and I talked about this on the last video. I do want to create another hidden minion called Twingo and I don't think I have all of the parts that go into him because I was stupid and I didn't plan ahead, so that was totally my bad. Okay, I should probably hit him again, but oh man. If he breaks out of this, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I'm probably gonna just fucking reload because I don't wanna lose a cocoon. And we literally just started, so I'm not even gonna sweat this, but let's see if Levant can capture him. Fingers crossed. So yeah, while Levant is going through these motions, which we've seen a bajillion times, uh, just to update you guys on things going with me, um, I've been just working a lot and Oh my goodness, I had a bit of bad fortune strike, maybe it was three days ago. My car, which has been in tip-top shape for a long time, I've never gotten to an accident with it or anything, just randomly the, I don't, I don't even know what it's called, it's like some belt thing just like broke and so now my steering wheel won't move and I'm really, really upset about that but I guess, I guess it happens and that's how it goes. Oh, you know what? Just for XP, I'm going to fight this guy. I will be back in just one second, my lovelies. Okie dokie. Alright, so we're going this way. Let's continue. And honestly, <laughs> I have no idea where I'm going, so I guess we'll see. I think that's the Shulia minion that I said that I went back to capture. And holy shit, I just realized... Vaughn's health is pretty fucking low, so I probably should give him a muggy just so he doesn't die. Alright, so let's just take this guy out. Yeah, why not? Let's do it. So hopefully you guys are doing well. Oh my gosh. Well, he exploded. I was not expecting that level of an ass kicking to tell you the truth. But alright. Let's, uh, oops. Wrong button. Oh man, I never know where to fucking go guys. Uh, I guess let's go here. 
Maybe this will lead us to like a treasure chest or something. Oh. Or not. Okay. As I said, just to get as much out of the videos as possible, I'm going to cut out some of these fights, especially since we've seen these minions. So I know you guys like some of them, but yeah, I don't want this video to just be full of fights. So BRB. My goodness, those stupid rad todons just will not fucking die. And can I go into those... <sighs> oh, what the hell. I might just leave in every other fight. So yeah, I hope you guys are ready for lots of stories from me. And Sherrick fucked this thing up, so we'll just bring him out again. So yeah, this fucking belt, maybe it's called the timing belt? I don't know. I know I sound like a complete noob talking about cars, you guys. But whatever it was, it just randomly broke and... Andrew and I haven't even had time to like take him into the shop between me working and him going to his classes and he's actually really liking his university which makes me really happy for him and uh I don't what do we go down here Ooh, a treasure chest Irvy's blessing sparrow rough and more great walnuts you know what I will go ahead and just use one of these fucking great walnuts I've been really stingy, and it's not here, it's in here. I've been really stingy, and I have not fucked with them at all. But I think I should be okay. I've been preparing myself for this. Okay, so... Let's see what it says. Made of sparrow feathers boosts the heart and mind. So it probably raises Levant's... HP, possibly. But I don't know if that's worth it. I think I quite like... The silver crown a little bit more mm, but it would give us a nice boost to our speed wouldn't it well I am just gonna not worry about it so whatever I think it's okay so let's see what else is in this area can we go anywhere else or literally we came here just to find treasure I mean after all of the fucking stress I put myself through in the spider forest. Now I just want to make sure that I find everything. And the perspective, I know you guys are probably so sick of listening to me bitch about that, but I really don't like it. Because sometimes it seems like you should be able to go someplace and then it turns out you actually cannot. So I don't really understand that. But that's okay. The background is lovely. The music is lovely. Really am enjoying this game. I'm for sure going to play the second one for you guys. I'm not sure when though. I probably need to, oh my gosh, this guy's like right in my face. I'm not sure if I want to draft like a timeline, but I do have a lot of stuff that I am wanting to play, so it's just kind of just deciding what I want to do. And I'll bring out Preston, and I won't make you guys watch this. I think I'll stick with every other fight just so this isn't riddled with battles, but you guys can still have that experience of watching me. All right, that guy is dead. So let's run this way. I'm actually not sure where the hell am I. <laughs> Guys, like where am I going, seriously? Uh, was it this way? You guys are gonna have to give me a second to figure out what the fuck I'm doing. Okay, let me just... <sighs> no. Go away. I don't want to deal with you. Okay, so I came from here. Okay, so... <laughs> I know, watching me is probably, like, so painful for you guys, but, uh, okay. So I just went south, and I don't really like that. So let's try going over here to the right. Ooh. Have I been here before? This is why I need you guys here with me. I probably should start streaming, especially when I'm playing games like this, because whenever I'm trying to like do it this way, it just seems like I get myself lost and I can't remember where I've been, where I'm going. And with games like this without a map, I feel like some aspects of it are really unforgiving, so I don't want to skip anything or miss a part. So, I don't know. Um, fucking die. And yeah, after we're done doing all of this stuff, 
Uh, I believe there will be a point, if I recall correctly, from those of you who sent me a lot of advice and tips and tricks for this forest, there will be a point where it will be kind of obvious that it's the point of no return, so I'll go ahead and cut the video there, even if we're not at the, I guess, stopping point or at the end mark for the video, because, like I said, I do want to like run back and grab a couple of minions. So we have three empty spots left, and I'm pretty sure I captured all of the minions that are to be found in the moth forest, so I just gotta decide what do I want to get. But alright, let's keep going. Uh, can I go this way? Oh, I can. Uh, uh, how about let's go to the right? Oh, cool, another chest. Fantastic. Yay! Preston leveled up. That is always welcome. So I'm going to try to like spread out the XP and let them level up semi-evenly. All right, let's see what's... Fuck you, Levon. Locked? I thought I had a key. Did I not get an extra key? Oh my god, guys, that is so lame. Hmm. I thought for sure I picked up a key. What is the larva key? Oh yeah, okay, that was for somewhere else. How fucking lame is this? So there's a key somewhere, and I don't have it. Okay, no problem. Let's just run back. But I thought for sure I had picked one up somewhere. Hmm. Okay, we'll come back here. Maybe I didn't look very well in the other area? Oh my god, this guy's got to stop just like popping up out of nowhere. But you know what, if the fucking key- Oh, I guess I did use it in this area over here, didn't I? Hmm. Who would have thought I'd end up being like one key short? Jeez. Minions, why? Why do you mess with me so much? Well, whatever, guys. Ultimately, if I'm missing a key and I can't find it, whatever. I'm not going to worry about it. But I gotta say, it is fucking aggravating. Well, as I was starting to say anyway, I think I might start to transition into streaming, possibly, since... I have a really good friend and she's really into streaming and it seems like really fun. Well, I don't know if it's really fun, but it seems like it's pseudo engaging. I mean, getting to like read people's comments as you play, although I guess there'd be a lot of hecklers. So I don't know if I'd really want to deal with people's trolling. But I guess you get that on YouTube as well, so... Okay, I was already here and there was a key that had been over there. So I've scoured this area. I feel like I've looked all through here. Like, where could this other key be? And surely it wouldn't be past that room unless I went in, like, the wrong order since I'm just kind of bumbling around. You know what? Whatever. Fuck it, guys. I will just move on. Hopefully we'll find a key. If we don't, uh, that sucks. But so far, the stuff that we've been finding in the boxes, honestly, they haven't been... Thing. They haven't been that life changing or life altering at all. It's just it's just kind of been, oh that's great, you know, got another key. Okay, and I went this way, right? Yeah? Was this where I just was? I think so. Yeah, okay. That like what the fuck? I don't understand. Why? Why won't you open? Ugh. Well, whatever, fuck it. Okay, so then let's go back this way. I don't know. Let's uh, try here. Is there nothing over there? Oh, there's a spot up here. Very cool. Oh my gosh. These minions are going to give me a heart attack, I swear. Alright, advancing onward. Uh, okay. Looks like we can't really go anywhere. Are those stairs? No, they're not. But we'll go this way. Oh my gosh. The 
This place really does remind me of the area in Fantasy Star Online Blue Burst. I still don't know what the place is called, but I haven't played that game in so long, but I have really fond memories of it. And yeah, sorry if you like see me like just hitting every wall. I'm just looking. There's gotta be a fucking key somewhere. Oops, let's go this way. So I probably do need to figure out some sort of schedule. Ooh, there's something up there. Like recording schedule, because I do want to adhere to something, but never know. Oh, there's a poacher. <gasps> Maybe he gives me a key, guys. I wonder if he will. Well, let's fuck him up. He shouldn't be a problem. I don't know, we'll see. Well, another sucker right where I want him. <laughs> Do you know how many of you have said that? Hey there, kid. Give me all your white cocoons. Fuck you. And I'm over now, and I won't kill you. Oh, you want to do it the hard way, huh? You'll regret it. Okay, so the douchebag wants to pick a fight with me. Oh man, I wish I knew what minions he's gonna use. I'm just gonna hit him first. Until I see what he summons. <laughs> Another goat. I am obsessed with these goats. They are so fucking adorable. And good thing I brought the beeb, so we are gonna annihilate this thing. I know guys, it's probably weird because it's not even the cutest minion, but I just love them. Like, why are they even called goats? I guess they're mildly reminiscent of an actual goat, but I'm not sure about the wings here. I wish I could capture his goat. And I feel so guilty. I don't want to kill you. Poor goat. You did nothing to deserve this. Oh, I'm all out of magic here. Although, honestly, at this point, I could probably take him out. I'm not afraid of dying like the last poacher we faced. Was I in the spider forest where I died with the bot? Oh, yeah, that was so fucking bad. I was pretty, pretty shocked. I did not expect to get my ass handed to me the way that it was. Okay, hopefully he'll give me a fucking key. No. No fucking key. I don't know. I have no clue. I can't believe I just lost a little kid. I guess I'm over the hill. I guess so. Maybe I should just retire. See you around, kid. Dude, like, am I supposed to feel sorry for him? He was being a total douchebag and a bully. Like, I don't fucking pity you, you asshat. Okay, well... I'm sure the pupa key is going to go to something significant, like opening the gate or something. But I'll try to access that chest one last time. And I feel like I've looked everywhere. That Oh, no, there was an area that looked like it had a tiny altar, which I guess is probably where we will insert this key. So we'll run back there. I'll try not to let this video go on for too long, guys. But... I think this is towards the end, and I don't want to end and start another video where I'm going to have to cut it short because, like I said, I do want to do some stuff off camera. I want to go back, I think, to the dragonfly forest, and, oh, no. Uh, I guess it can't be helped. I'm going to have to fight this thing. Okay. I'm trying to remember my pathing here. Oh yeah, it was up this way. Okay. Let's try this one more fucking time. Please, 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 please. No, why? Why? I felt like I had an extra key and now I have an extra treasure chest here. Well, I'll just keep fucking around with it and coming back. So let's go to where that stupid little area was. Oh my gosh want to fucking run into you. Ugh. Okay. Oh, shit. I guess do I want to go up? This was where I went, right? I 
think it, this had the little... Ah, yeah, there's the altar. Okay, so... Let's just give it a go. What is this? Oh, it's just a flower. Yeah, I'm getting paranoid, guys, if you can't tell. Okay. So we're gonna stick that in there, and I guess we will go ahead and call this a video. I don't think this is the end of where we need to be. Yeah, I don't think so. But we will go ahead and call this a video. What I will do, I guess, is I will, from this point forward, I'll just leave and go and handle some of my business off camera. And so when we come back together, I will be in this spot and we will continue exploring the forest together. So thank you so much for watching, guys. I am your host, Rabbit, and this is my playthrough of Jade Cocoon, Story of the Tamamayu. I will see you on the next video.